What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name's Savannah and it's so nice to have you. I thought it would be super fun to do a work day like or work night routine sorry so kind of starting to where i get off from work and then until the rest of the night i think these videos are super interesting to watch so what the hell i'm gonna do one too so it is now what time is it it's 5 23 i usually get off work around 5 or 5 30 and then as soon as i get home i get the heck out of these scrubs because they're dirty <laughs> so i'm gonna do that and then I'll check back in. All right, so I just got out of those scrubs, but really quickly, for those of you who may not know, I am a dental assistant, so I work a full-time job. I work Monday through Thursday. It's so nice having Fridays off, um, but I work very long days, so I go in at seven, and I usually get off, like I said, around five or 5.30. So as a dental assistant, I am on my feet pretty much all day long, except during treatment, which, Usually that's pretty quick stuff, so I'm not sitting that much of the day. So as soon as I get home, I like to relax for at least like half an hour if I can. So that's kind of what I'm planning on doing now. But I used to literally come home, get in bed, and fall asleep and waste the rest of the day, which was so bad and just made me feel like so irresponsible. So I am really strict on myself with, yes, you can lay down, but like the second I start to fall asleep, I have to get up because I hate taking naps after work because then I don't sleep at night and it just turns into this crazy sleep pattern that I don't want to have to like fix again. So I'm going to relax and rest my feet for probably like 15 to 30 minutes and then I'm going to get my two mile walk in. That's something I like to do every single day after work just to make sure that I get it in because if I don't make myself do it, then chances are it's not going to happen. So I'm going to chill out for a bit and then go on my walk. Okay, I just noticed myself getting very tired, so I jumped out of bed before I fell asleep, and I'm about to go on my walk, but I wanna show you guys something I like to use on my walks that makes me sweat a lot more. I've talked about it over on my channel before, but it is the Sweet Sweat. This is the Workout Enhancer, and then I also use the little wrap that you put around your stomach. Um, I'm not saying that this is like making me lose weight, but it just makes my stomach sweat a lot more, therefore it makes me feel like less bloated. Um, so I love using this in my walk, I just feel like it makes my walk feel way more intense since I'm sweating so much more. And then I also use it while doing a few little ab workouts that I do after my walk. So I'm gonna go crush this walk and then do a few more other workouts, stretch and then shower. Also, I love how I just said I'm gonna go crush this walk as if it's some like <laughs> huge workout. Like meanwhile, it's just a walk around the neighborhood, but guess what? It's still movement, it's still good for you. So if you're watching this right now, don't forget to move your body today. It will appreciate it so much. There's a drug, I don't want it. Because I don't have any self-control. The harder I try to get off it, the more I can see that I need it. currently dying I just did this workout so quick I don't know why but like since I was on camera I just wanted to like get them out of the way because I was really worried my camera was gonna die so I was doing them super fast but those are just a few workouts I do throughout the week I do sometimes throw in a few others which I might do a little later um, but right now I'm just kind of like tapped out but I'm about to go have dinner with my family and then take a body shower I personally do not wash my hair every night um, so I just obviously rinse my body off and then I actually do my hair at night. So I'll show you guys all that in a second. All right, it's now 7.44 and I'm sitting down to eat dinner, which is a little late for me. I usually like to eat before eight because I do intermittent fasting. So I start eating at noon and then stop eating at eight, but I'm gonna like, I'll be fine because I'll eat this pretty quick, but I just have a salad with chicken in it and then croutons and just some like dressing that came with the salad pack. Um, but I'm eating outside by myself because it's super peaceful out here and I just had a long stressful day It was just such a Monday So I'm gonna just sit out here and relax and enjoy this salad Just killed that salad and it's 758. So I did it in the right amount of time I am so sweaty still so I can't even believe I haven't showered yet But I just wanted to eat dinner first so I'm gonna go take a body shower 
and then really just start like my true nighttime routine. All right, I'm about to shower, like I said, but I really quickly wanna show you guys something I've been doing that has seriously changed the game. So I've always used a loofah, and obviously I'm sure you guys know what a loofah is, but if not, this little majigger thing here. And I recently switched to using these little exfoliating mitts because I'm not kidding, they give you like the butteriest, softest skin ever. And then I also, I'm out of breath, dude. That's so bad, I walk up the stairs and I'm like this out of breath. Anyways, I also have been using a shower oil instead of soap, and I feel like it just makes my skin so moisturized. I got it at Target. I feel like I showed that too quick, but this is it. It smells so good, makes my skin so moisturized, and that and this paired together is like a dream combo, so you guys should totally check that out. I got these at Walmart for literally like $2, so get them and thank me later. All right, so I just got out of the shower, and like I said, I do not wash my hair um, every night, and so obviously tonight was one of those nights. I just try to get as much wear out of my hair as I possibly can, just because it's not super great to wash your hair super often. I'm struggling, hold up, I need to redo this. <laughs> and I'm also struggling because I never have anywhere to set my camera in my bathroom, but let's fix these. So, I already washed my face in the shower. I always wash my face in the shower at night since I shower every night, and I use, I've shared this before on my channel, but ah, I'm struggling. I use the Rejuvi Facial Cleanser. It's so good, if you guys haven't tried it yet, you have to get it, and I know that probably isn't convincing considering I have this huge zen on my face, but trust me, my skin is usually so clear because of this stuff. This is honestly such a struggle. I just cut myself off. But as I was saying, I'm going to go ahead and finish my skin routine for the night. And all that is is putting the Rejuvi Skin Healing Gel, same brand, super good. I do three pumps of that. And then after I rub that in, I go in with my Kiehl's Ultra Facial Cream with SPF 30. This stuff is so good. Makes my skin look so glowy, but not in like a greasy way. So also, if you guys haven't tried this, you've got to do it. Honestly, the lighting right here sucks so bad. <laughs> I'm filming this on such a whim because I like randomly got this idea to do this today. So bear with me. It's fine. We still love it. It's going to be fine. <laughs> All right, and it is pretty early, but I'm going to go ahead and brush my teeth now because obviously I'm done eating for the day and just going to drink water. So I'm just going to go ahead and get that out of the way so I don't have to get out of bed to do it later. Okay, so this part of my nighttime routine might be a little weird, but I personally like to do my hair at night because I like to sleep in as long as possible and doing my hair is just a very time consuming thing and I just do not wanna to have to deal with it in the morning. So, like I said, I don't wash my hair every night so I'm going to curl my hair tonight and usually I can sleep on my hair and it be fine in the morning and if it's not, it's like way quicker to just touch up a few pieces than to do the whole thing. So, I'm going to quickly curl my hair. Ah. And since I didn't wash it, I am obviously going to use some dry shampoo. One I've really been loving is the Dove Care Between Washes. This is the Volume and Fullness Dry Shampoo. It's so good. So I'm gonna quickly do that, but really quick. I keep saying quick, yikes, I need to calm down. I wanna show you guys the curling iron I've been loving. So I have all, well, I've had the Baby Bliss Pro for a really long time now, but I had the one and a half inch and my hair just isn't quite long enough for that big of a barrel because I want the curls to have a little bit more volume in them. So with that big of a barrel, I wasn't able to wrap it as much. So I ended up getting the one inch and it has changed my hair game. So I'm going to go in quickly and just touch up my hair so I don't have to do it in the morning. Now that my hair is all curled, this is usually the point of the night where I get in bed and I'm either on YouTube, watching a movie, or on Instagram the whole rest of the night until I fall asleep. It's already 8.47 and I typically fall asleep around like, honestly lately it's been so much later which is so bad, but I'm thinking since I had such a long day I'll probably fall asleep around like hopefully 11 or 11.30 and no later than that. But I hope you guys enjoyed my work night routine. I will see you guys in the next video. And also, if you are new here, don't forget to subscribe. Bye, guys.